We begin tonight with more on the recently released MSTEP results from the State Department of Education. Some grade levels improve while others decline. For instance, third, fourth and 11th grade students scored worse in English year over year. Their scores dropped by 1%. The MSTEP looks at proficiency and breaks it down by how many students are either proficient or above the threshold. For third graders, only 39.6% scored proficient or above on the test. The Michigan Student Test of Educational Progress, also known as MSTEP, is a computer-based assessment. The state legislature made it law for all students in grades 3 through 8 to take the MSTEP starting in the spring of 2015. 11th graders take the SAT. The reading scores were incredibly concerning. Molly Masick is the Director of Education Policy for the Mackinac Center for Public Policy. She says they even saw drops in schools that usually perform better on these tests. In Midland Public Schools, third graders uh, dropped in proficiency from about 61% to close to 50%, comparing um, pre-pandemic to post-pandemic scores. Masick says money flowed into these schools during the pandemic, money that was used to address learning loss for students, and yet we've seen lower scores in 2024 compared to 2023. Moving forward, we would like to see those funds directed more efficiently uh, towards interventions that specifically target the development of literacy and these these other core academic skills that are so important to the students future success things have changed a little bit you know following the pandemic and it's throw it threw everything off and we look at test scores now uh, more as a snapshot in time and as a measure of a student's ability to fill in bubbles rather than perhaps their actual abilities. Thomas Morgan is the spokesperson for the Michigan Education Association, the state's teachers union. He says many factors contribute to the low scores. You know, we're still facing an educator shortage, especially in rural and urban school districts. We don't have enough trained, qualified educators to, to help every student achieve their best. Here's how students test scores rank now compared to when the M step was implemented. In 2014, 2015, 24.1% of third graders weren't proficient in English language arts. Now, 2023 to 2024 results show 35.4% of students aren't proficient in ELA. Compared to the previous year, 2022 to 2023, when 34.6% of students weren't proficient. Well, it's important to remember that the kids who are in third grade now are the same ones who started school behind a computer screen at the very height of the pandemic. Uh, so they've they've been behind the eight ball and, and facing challenges all along. Not all the scores were bad. Math and science in most grade levels increase, but still those reading scores are at an all-time low since the MSET began for students.